Welcome back my viewers and subscribers. I don't know if you guys have seen this video already but a video has been circulating on social media showing a big fight between some Meadowbrook High School girls and the rumor is that they're fighting over man and it is such a big disgrace. Based on what I'm hearing 16 of them will get detention and four of them will be expelled from school. And this is not just an issue for Meadowbrook High School, it's in all the schools. It is just that the one at Meadowbrook High School was caught on video. But I witnessed a lot of, of fights in the schools, especially the one that I teach. But the students are asked not to record them. And if the students record the fight, they will be punished. And this is the case here at Meadowbrook High School. The person who recorded this fight is going to be penalized for recording the fight and for sending it out in the public domain. And I see a problem with that. We need to know what is happening in the schools. Gone are the days when these bad things happen in school and we don't know anything about it. So the image of the school remains squeaky clean while behind the gates is just a pure mess. And I'm glad, glad that the issue at Meadowbrook High School has been exposed and then it can be dealt with properly. I'm tired of the band-aid effect of covering up the sore without cleaning it out. They need to get to the bottom of this mess and fix the problem. At least when this information is out on social media, we get the help that they need. But let me tell you something. Meadowbrook High School has gone to the dogs. I taught at Meadowbrook High School as well. And the students were well behaved at that school. They didn't have any fights. The girls were proper young ladies and the boys behaved like gentlemen. And they had no, none of these kind of brawling behavior. This kind of behavior we expect from other kinds of school, but not Meadowbrook High School. So everyone is so shocked. But this is what COVID has caused. COVID is just one of the factors, but there are several other factors that could have caused this kind of behavior. It goes down to renting. It goes down to the values and the attitude that has been passed down to the children. It goes down to what happened in those children's lives while they were during the COVID pandemic. So there are so many things that need to be fixed. So the fact that this video went viral should not be a problem. The person, the person who sent out the video probably did the school a favor. So the principal should not punish this child for that. Let me know what you think about this incident in the comments.